Greetings, fellow travelers. Obix here with Nash Rack coming at you from Up the Mud 3. How you doing, Nash? I'm tired as crap. Okay, well, it's about 8,000 degrees in my house, so hey, yeah. we're, we're a pair. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, but fast. we are here for you people. Despite oh, yeah. him being tired, what? Um, hot. And I mean, I'm hot all the time. I'm dead sexy, but let's talk now. Come well, on. Come well, on. Look at there's this. Something Look at missing. This game. There's something missing here. My, my coffee machine is missing. You took away the power and the water. No uh, one around the tired. Was, the coffee machine was there. I put the coffee machine back. Yeah, but there was no power. You pulled the plug. No, you pulled uh, the water. I did, I did pull the plug, and I did pull the water. I will fix eventually. Eventually, he says. But I spent like a, like eight hours working on our house, Nash Rack. Right. I was a little tired and couldn't be bothered to plug a coffee pot back in. That's why I'm eating vitamin C. <laughs> and we've decorated for Halloween. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Or oh, we haven't. You have. <gasps> Stop playing with the lights. <laughs> <laughs> so let's show them what we did. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Things uh -huh. look a little bit different out here, and we have decorated for Halloween. So there you go. Yeah. Nash hadn't even noticed that the pumpkins are different. He's a little slow on the uptake. Oh. One has a meaner face than the other. Oh, yeah. No, nope. didn't know this. Doors are switched out for blood wood because that just makes Halloween. Yeah. And cool stuff. somebody's cool stuff. been working out on the big building. The big windmill now has a big square on top of it. It looks <laughs> yeah. a lot less square than it did earlier. So that yeah, did good. I'm working on it. It's work in progress still. It's big looking box. much better than that garbage thing we built day one on it. Yeah, but the dimensions are all wrong, so yeah, we'll see what what it becomes. Work in progress. Yeah, work in progress. Oh, you have hay bales here. Yes, well, it's that's a fall thing, right? So, oh, is it? Fall time of year, hay bales, and you take hay rides through the pumpkin patch, and uh, is that just an American thing? I think that's an American thing. Yeah, don't so take hay rides through the pumpkin patch. Hay bales fall on you when it gets cold. I don't get it. Hay bales are warm. <laughs> are they? They're itchy. Oh, they are itchy. Yeah, I'll give you that. And we don't have uh, pumpkin fields. I have a pumpkin patch at my summer house. But you can have a look at Mr. Rich over here, Summer House. <laughs> oh, it's a cabin more. <laughs> it's, a, it's a room with a door and a garden. Nice. <laughs> yeah. So we switched the water for. We switched to all the oh, bottom of the yeah, yeah, pool yeah. for sand so it looks a little bit cleaner. Yeah, Ob Oblix was bored. Then the biggest work we did was down the stairs. And you can notice all the obsidian is gone. Yes. Well, the day's not over yet, but yes. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we have turned Ooh. the fishy room into a, I don't know, whatever, it's mezzanine a, maybe? I don't still know. a fishy room. And then we've opened up the room that was down here. You remember the oh, power yeah. oh, was right yeah. here. Oh, yeah. Someone standing. has been busy. And we moved all of our machinery down here. Uh -huh. and a new, we didn't build a new, new machinery. Oh, well, yeah, we did build one new one, didn't we? For some this work we were doing downstairs. It's some yellow stuff. We will see later. And then ignore that. It's not done yeah, yet. Yeah, ignore that. You haven't seen that. <laughs> you see nothing. 
And then we move the empower into here. Ah, uh, yeah, its own roof. With the weird uh, blue ceiling, because the lake's right above this and it drips yeah. water on our heads. Yeah, this is below the sandy bottom of the lake. Yeah. Yeah. And we connected it to our system so we can pull stuff out and then empower uh -huh. things. Uh -huh. Very handy. Used it a couple times already today. Oh, you did? I did. Nice. It was probably uh, stupid. The experience thing I had to empower river. Oh, okay. But then there we added another terminal here for when we're working yeah. down here. Lots of these. And up here we moved all the. You remember the crates were all right here. Oh yeah, those yeah 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 the door. And this the... was that's the same door to the outside. Yeah. We didn't move the door, but we yeah. I did move all the crates over here. Uh huh. And we went fully automated. I will show. If you look in here, uh -huh. you will see Stuff. the cables. The much faster cables coming oh, in, yeah. Oh, yeah. bring the items in, yes. and you will see on the back of the controller that there is a refined storage connector there. Uh, so everything on that controller now shows up in our refined storage system. Oh, okay. yeah. So oh, that's all the great. Fish... Yeah. So all the fishies and stuff will uh, now show up. In our storage system, we don't have to even come back in here if we don't want to. Uh, anything oh, that these. has a slot in the drawer will go into the controller and be put into the drawer. Oh. If the drawer becomes full, it will shoot it down to the trash can down here. Or if there's not a spot in the drawers, it will shoot it down here. Okay. Uh, it will try to. It will put books in this first crate, which oh, it has yeah, filled lots up. Of books. It will put books in the second crate. Which you took some out earlier, and it's already filled them back up. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, and then crap. it will put the bows in the third one. And then once it, anything beyond that, that it were, or if any of these are full, it'll just dump the rest in the trash. Huh. So Now, I haven't hooked these three up to our storage system. I could do that, but uh, it's, oh, it's a little is... hard to actually search the enchants you want. It's kind of easier yeah. just to, to roll your mouse over them here. And I could show the audience. This is my new enchanted super jump boots. <laughs> uh, really dangerous stuff. But I wanted the uh, depth, depth, depth strider. That's what I wanted. And that's a crap. And my helmet broke. So I have protection four on this one. Yeah. He's the Mobeta. Yeah. I had fire so protection have... one or something on the other one. If you look through that window right there, you see six repair reverse yeah. that he could have repaired his helmet, but didn't because he but kept it... dying. We He's were out. We were out exploring, uh, looking at the world around us, and it broke. How many and times did you die? Uh, three or four or something. How many times did I die? Uh... Shut up. Y'all go like and subscribe <laughs> on that <Netflix> video. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. <laughs> okay, he didn't die once. He's better than me. I know. I said they. But someone kept throwing creepers at me. That's true. That's oh, true. I did. Yeah. When I was building all this stuff, I did lose my shuriken somehow. Oh, I don't yeah. know what I did with it. And my shovel. So I had to build a new shuriken, and it's got a few new enchants that do some things. Uh, yeah. Fun things. It throws creepers. Yes. I and throw creepers. If I am out fighting a stud, skeleton, like, ah, he's way over there and shoots a creeper at the skeleton, I blow up. Kind of like Surprise! This. Yeah, kind of <laughs> like that, yeah. <laughs> Stop that. I don't think we did anything back there other than build a wall. And then, dun, da, da, da. Yeah, this is the same. Still, yeah. uh -huh. We built the room. We built the room. We actually spent a lot of time on this room. Yeah. Doesn't look like it, but. No, it doesn't look like about it. About <laughs> one and a half or two hours, maybe? Yeah, at least. 
Yeah. Tried uh, about every block in the game. Couldn't Twice. settle on the stuff we <laughs> would be happy with. And we were good with the walls and the ceiling, I think. It was the floor that was a trouble. Yeah. Yeah, these uh, center parts here. That was took the, all of, all of the time. It's but I think I like this of, one. It's got kind of an industrial vibe to it, like a mad scientist-y kind of lab. Yeah. And yeah. the yellow stuff down here. Yes. That's what we had the machine up there for. Do we have a bucket of that anywhere? I have a bucket of that in my backpack. That's energized glowstone. And it flows upwards. You want to see? Yes. And you can't swim in it, but it does make you no, glow and give you jump boost and speed. Oh, jump boost and speed too. Okay. See? Ow! <laughs> <laughs> I'm speedy. <laughs> playing with that anymore. <laughs> and we got a free end. Yeah, I heard it. It's light in the pal. It, it is light. Oh, well, right in the center, no, no, it's not no. light. Yeah, I know. The lamps around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. They light up yeah. this. Yeah. Around the outside, but not in the inside. No, we did add a door. Look, a fancy door. Yeah. Coming that still showing this thing. Going for the slaughterhouse look. Oh, the pipe's yellow too. Mm -hmm. Nice, 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 nice. Nice stuff. And yeah, some of these. Instead of Zombie. the boring torches. No boring torches. We actually tried it, like every lamp in the game. Oh yeah. <laughs> and settled on this one. The fancy doors. I do like the jail door. That is nice. Oh yeah. Noisy but nice. Secret door. Let's see him all sparkly. Yeah. So this is funky special glass that is dark. It won't let light through. Uh -huh. So when we turn off the lights, it stays very dark in there. Oh, yeah. And But it does let players pass through, and it does not let mobs. So, yeah. That's super fine. And then over here, we've added a, an experience collector. Because we switched out the spikes for these spikes. Huh. All and the work these spikes get experience. Huh. I really want to punch him onto there right now, but I won't because that'd be cruel. So that guy should get experience and it'll send it back to the store stores over there. The spikes will collect all the bits and send those back to the store stores over there. And Nashrax Moonwalking. Oh, yeah. Uh, you first, you first. <laughs> no problem, you first. <laughs> Let me out. And then the magic that makes the drawers work is back here. Oh, you're still there. Okay. So this pipe comes from the experience collector and the, uh, the, the cyclic device that's collecting all the bits and bobs. It's shooting them all up here into this drawer or storage controller. But if you look at this filter, we are preventing bows, belts, and boots. The bees. I fell in a hole. <laughs> then uh, the bows, belts, and boots will continue on down the path. If we look at this filter, we're filtering bows. So the belts and boots will fall in. But the yep. bows will continue on. The bows will end up over here. Eventually, we'll turn this into a trash can, but I just want to make sure we're not missing anything else before uh, we do that. Yeah. Now, the belts and boots will queue up in here and then slide down into this auto crafter. You notice we've blocked out all but one area. 
they'll pop into there, they'll get crafted into that leather, and then be pulled out of there and shot up here into that drawer right there. Yeah. And then you will see we do have refined storage connected to that controller, so we can see all of these goodies up in our storage system. So, which we did put one down here. Yeah, stuck on the door. Right there. So everything oh, yeah. in here will show up in there. And upstairs in everywhere else we have one of those. Oh, yeah. Yay. Yes. And this is the, the collector we were talking about. We showed this in the last episode, I believe. Oh, uh, yeah, we did. So that is gathering all the goodies. Now, we need to make this thing work, man. Yeah. I mean, I, to be fair, everything but the blaze bits. Yeah. I just put those in for placeholders. Everything else has been collected by this thing passively as we've just been sitting here working on this room. Mm -hmm. So it has killed all these things while we just chilled out in here and decided on a floor. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. That's it, important. It, it's, obviously, it's obviously working. The farm oh, yeah, it is, is working. working. It is working. So oh, we yeah. need to make it work more. So first Let's thing we got to do is get our blaze going. Now, what uh, happened to our spawner? No, uh, it's probably in my bedroom still. <laughs> <laughs> I watch your videos, man. There it is. I, I see what you do. <laughs> About a week later. <laughs> so here's our blaze spawner. Uh, mm -hmm. Now, we probably want to set a way we can turn this on and off, but for right now, let's just wing it. I guess it's going on that block over there. Yeah, but you know what we should put in place first are the things that are going to push the mobs towards the conveyors. Because oh, we okay. only have conveyors right here, and that's the intent. We don't want to cover the whole floor oh, with conveyors. Yeah. But we need a thing that pushes the mobbies. Oh, okay, okay. So uh, let's build uh, a couple of those. That's going to be from Cyclic. And it is a funky looking little thing. There it is. An interdiction pulsar. Uh huh. It's relatively cheap. Got one? Okay, okay. No. What good are you, man? What's it called? What? I just told you. Interdiction pulsar. <laughs> I just don't From... listen to you. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Inter something pulse something yeah one of those now I'm hoping uh, one will cover the whole room but I don't know if it will I already made one by the way You're too slow why what oh we don't have enough stuff so, so if we put this stone? here like a soul. It should push the mobs within 32 blocks away from us. Or away from itself. Oh, we don't have enough glowstone, dude. I did use a lot of glowstone in the floor. Yeah, for this. Of course, the blocks kept disappearing. Well, and the floor upstairs has a ton of it in there, too. So. Yeah. So I put our interdiction pulsar down over here. Uh -huh. Is one enough? And it's pulsaring. I think so. We'll have to wing it and see. If not, we may have to go get some more glowstone and put a couple more in. But I think it'll work. Uh, I've never actually used that before, so we're going to give it a whirl. Huh. So now I think we're ready for... Blazification. Uh, and now, there is a, a room under here that's open to the yeah, world. It's a cave. Uh, I don't want to put it too low and have them spawn in that cave. So I, I think maybe let me get some uh, blocks to pillar up there. We'll put it up a little bit higher. Hmm. Well, so Somewhere. We should probably go. I think we lit it up pretty good, but I think we should. I don't know. If 
fill it in or put water Where over was it, or it? Something. The cave? Yeah, wasn't it in here somewhere? No, you can't get to it. We sealed it all off. Oh, you did it. Okay. Well. Okay. Now, technically, that doesn't need to be. The lights don't need to be off for that spawner to work. It should just work. Oh, oh yeah. it did. It works. Oh, and they did. They did get pushed. Oh yeah. And they are getting murdificated. Oh yeah. That sucker. I would say that is a successful test, and their bits are flowing oh, through yeah. the pipe. Oh yeah. Success. I love when bits flow through the pipe. Yeah, there was one blaze rod and one heart. And now there's four blaze rods and one heart. Oh, this works great. I wonder what I don't. I'm wondering if we can enchant these spikes. Ooh. Enchant spikes. With looting? That would. How awesome would that be? Okay. That may be a thing. It seems it to be working. It is a little slow to move the items. Probably want to move to some faster pipes, but... We have two hearts and six rods, so it's doing its thing. Oh, yeah. So now, the hard part. Nash rack. Yeah. The hard part. What? You have to go in there. Of course I do. And stand right underneath the spawner. Uh -huh. And the block directly under the spawner, touch that to it. I bet he needs a new hey. helmet soon. <laughs> I'm scared. And you turn off the lights. <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> you bastard. Oh, yeah. I'd recommend you leave. <laughs> <laughs> I already left. Oh, yeah. So, this is a cursed earth farm. Uh -huh. And it spawns what's called disturbed mobs. Okay. At it's an extreme rate. <laughs> They're loud. Even when we're close. <laughs> I'm gonna turn my sounds down. Even more. There we go. One percent should do just fine. <laughs> yeah, it's fine up here. So, it it they they come in at a pretty good rate. Uh, yeah. Look inside this little thing right here. We're definitely going to need faster cables. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just see little <gasps> body parts falling. <laughs> uh huh. There's a witch, there's Enderman. There. <laughs> If you turn the lights on, it slows it down, but doesn't turn it off. <laughs> it's just watching all the goodies. Yeah, I was watching how long it takes them to it's starting to disappear now. If I were to bust this glass out right now. You uh -huh. would be so dead. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Look at this. Moment. The constant flow of giblets. It's a slime trophy. Oh, I didn't see the slime trophy. Yay! <laughs> Woohoo! Doesn't do anything. Doesn't make the sound, yeah. Oh, you can't hear. I nice. will put this uh, lag. I will put this with the other trophies. So I am trying to kind of keep them sorted a little bit. Oh, you made this even. You were evil. What gave us a gold nugget? <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember what mob gives out gold nuggets. Other than zombie pigmen, but there shouldn't be zombie pigmen over here. Uh, don't witches do that? Do they? I don't know. That's news to me. I think I hear Blaze up here. Oh yeah, that's Blaze. Up where? Upstairs? Yeah. By the noise machine. Up here. I think it's behind the wall or something. It's not up here. There is. Should be a cave somewhere. Well, we know there's that room. Maybe they're, that's where they're at. Could be. Yeah, because I'm already past them. Yeah. Somewhere. So we can run down into that little room and check. Uh -huh. I think we can. I think there was a bust in point from the wall over here somewhere. Uh, I think. Oh, that. Okay. Liver. Sorry, I can't speak. I was just about to ask if you'd light the way. Oh, yeah. See, if I were you, I would have taken the torches out. Oh, room. I see no, no blazes. No. No blazers. Oh, I hear blaze, but that could be from inside. Yeah, but that's inside. Or they're spawning in the ravine. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. We're good. I think I heard I'm in the farm. Huh. Okay. So we have a delicious mob farm. Yes. Producing all manner of potatoes and carrots. Because, uh -huh. you know, that's what you need. <laughs> Where I don't remember which is doing gold nuggets. No, I don't know. Bottles and sticks, yes. Gold yes. nuggets. Uh, oh, zombies will drop like iron and get sometimes, right? Yeah, but not gold. Oh, so, so many good things. Let's I take one more look. Add it in full oh, swing. Crap.
look how fast it goes. Crazy pops. So this is obviously something you would not leave running in full mode. We would turn the lights on and just let it run in half mode. Yeah. Oh, we got an axe. Up an iron axe. I forgot we'd get levels <laughs> and things like that. Yeah, we have two, so... So many things! Let's go check the... Make sure this thing's keeping up. Oh! Barium dust. How did that end up in here? That shouldn't have ended up in there. I have no idea. Ah, it was tied to the mod. Okay, fair enough. And we got a bunch of bows in the trash can, so they're flowing. Need to get the trash can. And somehow we got this, uh... This might have been from when we were digging. Which one? Maybe not. I don't know. I'll throw it in here for now. And if we get more oh. of it, then I'll have to make a special thing for it. Oh. Have to add some more filters and such. Oh, we got an infinity card. That comes out of Enderman. Oh, oh that's where I got it. Oh, Enderian Dust. That came out of an Enderman. Our, uh, we're pretty much full. <laughs> we definitely um, need faster cables. Oh, yeah. Two minutes of running it. Not even two. It's already stuffed. Oh, yeah. I, I would call this a success, man. I mean, we're definitely, uh... Definitely getting the baddies. Definitely. Not a fan of the spiders climbing. No. You may want to put like spikes on the ceiling or something, and that'll take care of that. And eventually they get they come down and get got. But I like how the blades just fly across the room, <laughs> smack into the wall, and fall down to their demise. Are we getting solidified XP? Oh my goodness, we already got 646 solidified XP. Oh. Six hundred forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty-one. No. <laughs> Let's say our little uh, XP sucker is doing its job. Uh, yeah, and we seem to only need one of those things. That took, uh, I think, eighteen diamonds to make that. <laughs> so. Yeah. But I think it was worth it. It was worth it. Stupid axe. I gotta go put that in the. In the filter. We don't want axes. So we could put them in like a sawmill and grind them into their component parts. Oh, one more tank. All the things. All the things. I like their little heads poking out of the side. <laughs> yeah. So we should not have to go hunting Endermen for Ender Pearls anymore. Oh, that's nice. Yep. Yeah. I already got 52 blaze rods. Are cooking with gas. Oh, I heard a witch. Yeah. Oh, I see a witch. I see her little bottle. And there's her little head dying. And there's four gold nuggets in there now. 
It must be witches then. Oh, golden apple. Ain't nothing wrong with that, right? Think we got a good 68. Skeleton skulls, need some more with the skeleton stuff. There. Keep it nicely organized. Noise. Did you turn your sound down? No. Crazy person. <laughs> Die, Enderman scum. Sometime today. I do want to look into if we can enchant those spikes. Or the other ones, either one. Oh, one of the Endermen teleported. We're going to put a no teleport thing out. Oh. So they don't do that. Uh-huh. Oh, Dream dust. Got some of that. Yeah, let's go check the trash chest and see what showed up in there. I bet some more Endermen dust. Oh, it showed up here. Yeah, in the boot, in the boots and belts, yeah. boots and belts box. Lots of them. It's because their uh, boots and belts are from Terraquius, oh. and these little Ender dusts and all the little dust are also from Terraquius. So I have the filter set up to just basically filter the mod. Oh. So I'm gonna have to make some changes to that. To stop that and probably put some compacting drawers in here and that will take make these go into their thicker components same with the gold nuggets yeah we'll I see. Get, and get some blocks and such uh -huh. mm -hmm. <laughs> we got a chicken <laughs> what it's a chicken it had chicken. to be a chicken jockey <laughs> oh cool and we can put that over here with the other food items. Oh, we got 18 gold nuggets. This is actually a decent gold farm. <laughs> yeah. That's already drained. We can crank it up again. But... Any hoozle. I think that is all the time we got for this episode. Uh-huh. But we sure do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with us. As we fired up the mob farm of doom and destruction. And oh, showed yeah. you all the changes we've made to the, the house and setup in the last little while. Yeah, lots of changes. And we definitely want you to go smack that like ah. and subscribe button. He was trying to get away. He didn't do a very good job. Uh. <laughs> Smack it, smack it ah. like a smack nose rack. <laughs> smack it. Smack rack. <laughs> smack rack. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh. There we go. Now we do, 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 do. Get that Disney. <laughs> no, no. You broke lava. a torch. <laughs> no, I didn't. I'm dancing. <laughs> Gonna get you, gonna get you, gonna get you. <laughs> I have death right. <laughs> 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 it's gonna love me. Oh, so original. The obsidian is back. <laughs> it's growing like mushrooms. <laughs> and if you guys want to play with your friends, like I play with mine and beat them up and put obsidian on their feet and <laughs> just do crazy, silly things, y'all go check out Crazy Gamer Hosting. They will give you a discount. It is in the down yonder. And oh, yeah. gives you 20% off your first purchase. Doesn't matter if it's a year or a day though i don't think they sell days but That's you're a month maybe so. how about that okay. yeah <laughs> anyway we will catch you guys in the next 
the episode. We will. Bye. Bye bye. Ow.